everybody welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here my name is phil in case you're clicking this video for the first time you are very much welcome i am back with another easy recipe for you guys and today we are doing sausage rolls y'all this one is so so good such an easy snack that you can make in no time because you only need three ingredients for this i will call this a snack and you can also make it as a starter for maybe a small party or maybe if your friends are over or maybe for your family it is so so good and also the kids are going to love this so I've just made it with some puff pastry which is store-bought because making puff pastry at home is stress guys and I'm also making it with some spicy beef sausages you can make it with any sausage that you like and also you'll need some eggs so I've listed all that in the description box down below don't forget to check on that so without saying more let's get started <laughs> So guys, this is going to be really quick. As I've mentioned earlier, I'm using spicy beef sausages. You can go ahead and use any sausages that you like. I also have some store-bought puff pastry. I like buying them from the stores because let me tell you guys, making puff pastry at home is not easy and it takes time as well. But if you have time, you can go ahead and make some at home but i always prefer just buying it i'm also using one egg which you will just use for binding the ends of the pastry so next we're just going to remove all the casings of the sausages because we don't need that so make sure you've removed all the casings and once you're done put that aside as we go to our next step So guys, I just want to take this opportunity to thank you for being on this channel. Thank you to everyone who is always trying my recipes. It always makes my day. And if you're watching this for the first time, if you're new here, you are much welcome. Don't forget to subscribe for more of my amazing recipes. So as you can see, our sausages are done at this point. So we'll just place that aside. Next, you're going to crack our egg. So for the egg, we're going to need just the egg yolk. As you can see, I'm separating the white and the yolk. So we'll need the egg yolk later to brush our pastry, which will give it a very nice golden color once it's baked. So now to our puff pastry so when normally it's bought it's always frozen and also when you come with it at home obviously you'll put it in the freezer so what you'll do when it's time to use it you'll first remove it from the freezer and let it thaw for about 30 minutes to one hour or until it becomes soft and that is when you just separate it and as you can see I'm just adding my sausages so make sure you size it very nicely so that they don't bulge out of the pastry and and once you're done, we are going to take our egg yolk that we made earlier and then we're just going to spread it on one end of the pastry. And now we just roll it over from a log like shape like the way I'm doing it here. Make sure all those ends are nicely sealed. So once you're done, you'll just place that aside and continue with the other remaining puff pastry.
now we are done wrapping the sausages in the puff pastry. So for our next step, we're just going to take your knife and you're going to make small slits on top of each roll as you see the way I'm doing it here. Once you're done, you're going to cut these rolls into smaller sizes like bite-sized pieces. That's fine as you see the way I've done it here. And once that is done, you're just going to line them in your baking tray. So here I have my baking tray that has a parchment paper. I've lined my rolls very nicely. So I'm just going ahead to spread the beaten egg yolk. This will give them a nice golden color once they are baked. So you're going to put this in a preheated oven at 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 180 degrees Celsius. And you're going to bake this for just 20 minutes. And let me tell you, they will come out super golden. They are looking yummy. They smell amazing. You are going to love this so you can serve this immediately when they are still hot because i like serving them when they are still hot they are so so good so go ahead serve them you can serve them with any sauce that you like i served mine with some ketchup and you can also pair it with your favorite drink so the spicy sausage just tastes amazing and the puff pastry is super crispy on the outside it just gives you a nice crunch in your mouth so i hope you guys try it and i hope you enjoy and that's what we're making today guys thank you so much for watching this video as you can see it is so easy to make the sausage rolls hope you guys are going to try it and let me tell you everyone is gonna love it make it for your friends make it for your family make it for your kids they are gonna really love this so i hope you guys try it as usual if you try it don't forget to tell me how yours came out in the comment section down below also don't forget to subscribe for more of my amazing recipes we can always connect on instagram or on tiktok at fields underscore kitchen so in my next video guys Bye!